This is Gary Atensi with CNTV, and today we're in Denver, Colorado. I'm here at Brows and Beauty Med Spa. Since 2015, they continue a lifetime committed to the beauty of over 5,000 clients, providing great work and great customer experience. Built by customer referrals. I'm joined by Betty Chavez, who is the owner, Hi, how are founder. You? Thanks so much for joining us here today. Thank you for having me. Let's start off a little bit about yourself, Betty. Um, you've had over 15 years experience in the clinical and medical field. Uh, you became a medical esthetician uh, seven years ago. Yes. Initially, you were educated with a bachelor's degree in business administration, yes. but your ongoing education has provided you a master level certifications that you have obtained across the United States, really from the East Coast to the West Coast in major cities. Share with me a little bit how this passion got started for you. Well, one day I, I have a friend who is in the beauty industry and we start talking about beauty and she, she guided me to uh, permanent makeup. So I start doing research about microblading. At that time, microblading it was very new. So that's when I decided to start searching and, and getting enrolled. And that's yep. how my career started. And obviously, um, every state and every uh, law is different in every state. So when I find out that I have to be an esthetician in Colorado, I got enrolled, which it was really very, very exciting for me. And that's how my career started as a medical esthetician. I came to be an esthetician and then I keep learning and I came to be a medical esthetician. Thanks to your friend who introduced you to yes, it. Yes, definitely. You've done it and never looked back. Yes. I mean, the quest to look better and feel better has existed through the ages. Is it exciting to be in an industry that is constantly improving and finding new ways to help us do that? Yeah, definitely. Like uh, we just came from Vegas uh, from Aesthetic Show and there is so many new products coming to to Colorado that we're going to be bringing in new services too. That is exciting. Yes, it's very Obviously, exciting. your clients are the ones who benefit from when you go out, you're able to find yes. new things for them. I mean, we live and in a, a beautiful state of Colorado. Most love the outdoors, but the weather, the climate, it can cause issues in our quest for healthy skin. Oh. Um, is a proactive approach to skincare important for people here? Oh, yeah, definitely. And it's very encouraging to tell our clients to use sunscreen. Okay. A lot of our clients don't use sunscreen. So here in Cardo, that we are a mile high and closer to the sun, it's very important to take care of yourself using sunscreen as a basic and definitely taking care of yourself coming to the spas and, and taking care of your skin. So definitely proactive. Um, I see that yes. you offer almost, I mean, nearly a dozen different facials for your clients out there. Depending on the client's skin type, are you able to help them choose what will best stimulate, repair, or even rejuvenate their skin? Definitely, but also one of the things is that I listen to you. I listen to my client, what's your main concern? Because uh, you can come to me and you can tell me, well, what will you do to me? We start with what's your main concern first, and then from there we, we start working with your skin to get to the level that you wanna be. Excellent. So really, the first step is really to analyze the skin yes, and definitely. the issues of each client. So is this a customized approach? I imagine this isn't a yes. one size fits all. No, it's like a, it's, it's, it's a customized approach, definitely, because the client, for example, you can come to me and have mm -hmm. hyperpigmentation okay. and also aging. But what's your main concern? Hyperpigmentation or aging? We cannot work both things at the same time. We have to we have to work one thing at one one thing at a time. So really prioritize which yes. one's important to you, then move to the next one once yes, you've definitely. accomplished that. Mm -hmm. I mean, let's face it, most of us could benefit from a, a perk me up, a little lift and tighten. Are chemical pills still kind of the go-to solution when it comes to seeing great results in that area? Yes. Yes, definitely we want to still do chemical pills regardless if your skin is perfect. Because a, a lot of people ask me this, um, well, Betty, you have a beautiful skin, mm -hmm. I like it. And by my age, I think I, I've been taking care of my skin a lot. But chemical pills is still, even though you have really good skin, it's very, very recommended to still For have. For someone out there who's not familiar with a, what a chemical pill is, uh, maybe uh, they have fear about that, Touch a little bit on that procedure. What happens when we're doing a chemical peel? So when we're doing a chemical peel, we're using chemicals 
mm-hmm. but we they're controlled chemicals by the technician. Okay. So so what we do is um, we put the chemical on the skin and and we exfoliating deeper on okay. that and on the epidermis to have better results. And so, so the, the client, the client will live with the chemicals on their skin, but obviously they're control. They're yep. control so, chemicals. So this solution helps exfoliate the skin Definitely. and and rejuvenate it as well. Yeah, I mean, and also it helps with hyperpigmentation and even acne. Many folks out there, I imagine, are familiar with facials, but not so many have heard of some of these new advances like that of dermaplaning, uh, microneedling. Touch on those a little bit for me, just to give them an idea what that what that's all about. Well, dermaplaning is also an exfoliation, but okay. it helps to remove all the dead cells and all the fuzzy hair that we have when you do dermaplaning. So it's very, very, very nice facial that we recommend for brides or quinceañeras or when you're gonna have a special event. Now, uh, um, what's the other one? Microneedling. That one we call it vampire facial because okay. we use plasma. We use your own plasma and and also stem cells during the procedure. Yes. That is amazing. I mean, skincare now is so much more than just facials, obviously. Uh, as the name states, your business name, this is a med spa. I mean, these are medical treatments, uh, fibroblasts, dysport injections, fillers. Are these less invasive that a lot of people think they are? I mean, people many times are fearful of things they don't know about. Tell me a yeah, little bit. Yeah, yeah, definitely. It's scary. But everybody, when I talk about Botox, is like, oh my God, I don't want to look like a, like a table where right. I'm not going to be able to move. But definitely, it's we're going back to the same thing. Every client is different. Okay. So if you do one movement on your forehead, on your eyes, when you laughed, even on your glyvella, um, we, which call it the 11s, we can still do that with Botox. We just put less percentage of the, of the product. Interesting. I mean, as we strive for a natural look, is the use of stem cells, platelets, is all that able to help achieve that natural look? And were these kind of really big breakthroughs in your industry? No, uh, for, I don't quite remember, but I believe like five years ago okay. or six years ago, it came legal, the stem cells. So that's why you we can hear more people talk about stem cells because it came to be legal in the United States and also approved by the FDA. So all the stem cells that we use here on the spa, uh, they're approved by the FDA. Obviously, you have to make sure that the spa who take care, takes care of you and is giving you stem cells, they have to be approved by the FDA. That is interesting. Mm-hmm. I mean, a great deal of us... Um, I mean, a great deal of what you offer really helps our skin to be healthy. Uh, and as I look on the TV screen every day, I literally just want to look better. I want to look like I did years ago. Um, when we when we look good, is it safe to say that we feel good about ourselves as well? And as one of the results that people probably get from your services is confidence. Is that mm-hmm. something you notice with clients? Definitely. Definitely. But I can tell you it takes time. Okay. If you take care of yourself, early stages, you're going to see better results than waiting until your skin has breakdowns. And when I say breakdowns, I'm not talking about wrinkles. I'm talking about acne. I'm talking about wrinkles. Okay. So you're talking proactive is the way to go. Yes, I mean, proactive. Catch it when it's early, yes. catch it when it's there compared to waiting later, then it's going to take a lot more time. I yes. Imagine. When your skin, that's how, in our spa, this, that's how we call a wrinkle, broken skin because your skin is already broke through huh. the middle. So to re- to rehab that, that part of the skin, it takes longer. Wow, And it's more time. Mm-hmm. I mean, as we live in a busy world, our looks can take a back seat many times as we rush out the door. Um, we have limited time. How can permanent makeup, even waxing, save us time kind of in our daily lives? Yes, because uh, if you wax your legs and you go to the beach, you can, you're, you're gonna look good for I will say two weeks, three okay. weeks, and you don't have to be shaving. Oh, that is nice. Yes. You started with permanent makeup. Do people enjoy that convenience of permanent makeup, um, not having to reapply every day? For the permanent makeup, for yes, definitely. It changed your life, it changed your face. Uh, definitely the permanent makeup will help you. Even for older people, okay. this we will help a lot because for example, if we do the eyeliner, they don't have to worry about be putting the eyeliner and making it wrong for them. 
Interesting. Yeah, so, we do permanent makeup, eyeliner, eyebrows, and lips. Primary, what really you started with was the permanent makeup, permanent ink. Um, is that still something that people seek you out for? And is that something you still enjoy doing? Yes. Yes. I will say 80% of my clients look for me starting to with permanent makeup. And then from there, we go to skincare. And skincare from there. Yes. Um, but the starting point, like you say, that's kind of where they seek you Yes, out. everybody looks for me for permanent makeup first. Let's touch on a little bit of that for the viewers out there. Um, eyebrows. Obviously, I see um, good eyebrows and I see bad eyebrows. Yes. Um, tell me a little bit about how you're able to help folks in that area. Well, definitely, um, there is a lot of people out there that they don't know that we can remove them. If you have a botched job, you can come to us and we okay. can remove it. Obviously, it will take a couple months okay. to have removed completely the job, but we can remove them. Um, in the other aspect, definitely when you come to us, we take measures. We make sure that we talk and you are happy with the design before we start working on your face. When it comes to eyeliner, how long does something like that last for folks? And is it something they can they can keep coming back for quite easily? Yes, eyeliner lasts, I will say it all depends on client, but mm -hmm. it, lasts, it can last from one year to two years wow. before you retouch the color. That is impressive. So yes. talk about a real uh, game changer when it comes to your daily regimen that you do. Mm -hmm. I mean, it takes time to do that. As far as um, lips go, can permanent ink be used on the lips as well? Yes, and there is a new technique um, called, um, by the name of hybrid lips. Uh, that technique, it will just help you to have just a little bit of color to make sure that your lips are even, but it's not that typical um, exaggerated color on your lips. It will give you that natural look. Folks out there that have gone through medical procedures, um, be it disease or whatnot, can they actually lose their eyebrows um, in that process? And is that something you can help with? Yes, we had a few clients who got car accidents and mm. due to the surgery, they lost completely wow. the, the brow and we make it for them again. We, we measure and make sure that we design the brows again and give them brows. That Even cancer clients, yes. So folks out there who come in for this procedure from you, um, they soon realize there's so much more that you offer Definitely. under one roof. And then obviously they can get some of those services as well. Do clients enjoy the results of what you provide, but also at the same time, the convenience that your service provides? Yes, yes, definitely. Um, and also people look at, they, they, they make an appointment with me okay. because I also I keep educating myself. I keep going through different um, uh, shows and programs to keep educating myself on permanent makeup. It's not only one time um, education I did. It's been through the years. Like for example, next week I'm going to El Paso for a master level lips. People will probably be very makeup. surprised on how much education ongoing that mm -hmm. really the both of you do. I mean, you have a partner that the both of you have worked hard to be the best at what you do. Um, you've traveled to get the best training. Uh, you're now able to bring these advancements to your clients here in Denver. Does this continue to be rewarding for both of you? Definitely. I'm very passionate. I love my job. I love what I do. Every client I see, I, I love to be with my clients. I don't do it fast paced. I give myself two hours and a half for each client because I want to make sure that she's not pressure and I'm not pressure. That is interesting. For someone out there who has never um, come into a med spa like this, uh, they're thinking about taking a proactive approach, um, but maybe they're nervous. Do you provide a consultation for them? And how does that work? Yes, we provide consultation over the phone. Okay. But also, if you're really, really nervous, we can provide consultation in person. Okay. But definitely when the clients come into the spa, before we go in into the room, I explain to them how the steps are going to be. And if they, if they, I always open myself for any questions. Interesting. So, so they can call you on the phone, even maybe send in images. Or you're whatever. not going to believe it, but they always call on the phone. They get the consultation on the phone and they still come here and they want more consultation. Like, okay, can I keep asking you questions? It's my face. I'm nervous. So that's why you get, I will say 99% of the clients that they never had anything done before. They're really nervous. Interesting. But 
Obviously, we, people we, are nervous about yes. things like that, but it, it's, it's for their best. Viewers, let's take a look at the bottom of the screen right there. And what we're going to see is their website. On the website, first of all, take a look at all their services they provide. We have touched on a few of them for you here today. Um, also, follow them on Facebook. They'll keep you apprised of uh, trending that they're going through, some great um, health skincare tips that you can carry on with you. Um, check out the reviews online as well. They have helped many. This is basically a couple that have an organization where they've decided that ongoing education is really important and critical to providing the best quality care for your skin for the folks here in Colorado. That is Brows and Beauty Med Spa since 2015, uh, providing great work and a great customer experience built by customer referrals. This is Gary Atencia with CNTV. And if you don't know, now you know.